So the centre of the world's macroeconomic growth is actually going to switch to this region, uh, and therefore this is probably the most important macroeconomic region. You'll also see a significant growth in the middle class take place, um, particularly in the APEC countries, and again that creates an enormously powerful backdrop for banking services. As the middle class grow, demand for wealth products increases dramatically. And if you reverse back from that, what governments need to do is build capital markets to create contractual savings industries, pensions, insurance.